Hey guys, what's going on? Chad here, and I'm bringing you another Maple Story video, and this is just going to be a quick little video, and I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get a quick 10 plus Unleashed coins so that you can start buying stuff from the Unleashed shop. And uh, to do that, you're just going to want to talk to Cassandra here, and these quests here always there. And for this quest, basically all you have to do is kill 300 monsters around your level. So I believe the range is 10 levels below you and 21 levels higher than you. So just go to a map with monsters that are around your level. I am going to go to... Um, how about Twilight Pyrion? I'm going to go there. Um, this map should do... And basically for this quest, all you have to do again is just kill 300 monsters, and that is it. And that will get you 5 Unleashed Coins, and you can do this once per day. So just repeat this quest daily, and you will get a lot of coins that way. So, I will be right back after I've killed 300 of these guys. And as you can see right here, it's telling me how much I've killed so far. So I will be right back once I finish killing 300 of these guys, and I will turn in the quest. So be right back, guys. Alright guys, we are just about done here. Got about 10 more to kill, so after this, I will go ahead and turn in the quest, and we will get 5 Unleashed Coins. So one more enemy here. Alright, as you can see, the quest is done now, so let's go back to Henesis. Or, well... Any town, really. You can do it any town that has Cassandra, which I think is most, if not all, towns. Alright, so we're back here. Click on Cassandra, turn in the quest. And that counts for your check-in for your attendance. And I don't know what this does, so maybe we'll get something decent from this. Um, let's see what this does real quick. Ah, potential scroll. Accessory int, cheese, and another int scroll. So nothing really good there. Alright, so the next thing that you can do to get Unleashed Coins is this Cold Hearted Mapler quest. This is something that you can do all day long. It takes 30 minutes. Um, you basically just have to stay online for 30 minutes and you'll get a coin. And uh, you can do this, it's repeatable all day long, and it's a great way to get one Unleashed Coin per time. So, alright, the next quest is this Warm Summer Tea, and this one is very easy, and you can do it as many times as you want. I only do it five times because Unlimited, or sorry, Evo World only lets you go in five times, so... I just do it five times. I don't want to waste my whole day doing these teabag things. So after you accept that quest, go into Evolving World if you're level 100 and up. Um, I would definitely recommend this. And get the 10% drop core. I've already got it, so I'm not going to buy it again. But you can buy it from the core shop. As you can see, there it is. So let's go ahead and start. And basically you just kill these monsters and they drop these tea bags, and you need 30 of them to complete the quest. Go to Link 3 once you're inside. And basically all the monsters, you see this little machine here, it starts bringing all the monsters to the center of the map. And basically you just kill them and you will see tea bags drop. And it really doesn't take that long um, as long as you can kill these monsters really quickly. So I will try to show you here in a second. I'm trying to get a tea bag to drop here. All right, so that's what they look like right here. And I will come back to you guys whenever. Okay, there's the machine. So it's bringing all the monsters to the center of the map. So just sit here and kill all the mobs. And uh, I will see you guys whenever I get 30 tea bags. So be right back, guys. Again. Alright guys, we are almost done here. I got about 8 more of these tea bags to grab, and as you can see, 3 have already dropped, so we're almost there. This machine's just bringing all the monsters to the center of the map again, as I said, and we should be done here fairly quickly. So, one moment. Just finish off all these mobs. Gotta love Evo World. And also, I have realize that in the quest description it does say that you need to kill monsters
that are near your level, but Evo World works just fine, even if you're level 200 like me. Um, I don't know if that's like a glitch or something, because these monsters only go up to level 160, and obviously that's not in the 10 level range, so... Um, again, I don't know if that's like a glitch or if that's supposed to be like that, but Evo World works just fine um, if you're level 200. So, we are done with the quest now. And really, it only takes like two minutes, so it's not really that big of a deal. Alright, so let's go back to Cassandra. Uh, it always spawns you on the opposite side of the map, too. That's kind of annoying, but... Alright, so let's turn in the quest. And there you go, you get one more Unleashed coin. So you can do Evo World five times a day. Um, once you're done with Evo World, you can go ahead and keep doing the quest. Um, just kill monsters around your level, and uh, you can just keep doing that, and you can get, you know, a lot of coins every day. Um, but I only go for around like 10 to 15 coins per day. Um, but again, there's nothing stopping you from doing more than that. But anyway guys, thank you for watching this short little tip. I hope you enjoyed the video. Like, favorite, subscribe, comment. Also, if you have any better ideas on how to get Unleashed Coins, let me know in the in the uh, comments below. I almost said description there. But uh, anyway, like, favorite, subscribe, comment, and toodles.